Hi everyone, thanks for joining me for these uh, introductory sessions on Psychology and Context. Over the course of the next few videos, what I'm going to be doing is introducing you to a range of different schools of thought in psychology. So really what this means is we'll look at charting the history of psychology in terms of how we've conceptualised the human mind and how we, uh, how we enact behaviour. So we'll start off with some really early conceptualizations of uh, kind of the philosophers and how they thought about the human mind before moving on to early psychological thought about psychodynamic principles. So we're looking specifically at Freud and Jung. We'll then move on to more scientific ways of understanding human behavior. So we'll look at the behaviorist principles of classical and operant conditioning before looking at more complex models of human thought in relation to cognitive psychology. We'll also touch on uh, humanistic principles, looking at hierarchies of need um, and self-actualization before looking at a more holistic evolutionary account of human behavior. Now, the reason that we're gonna be doing this at the beginning of term is because it really gives you a bedrock of not only how we've got to understand uh, the way that the human mind works today, but also it gives you a flavor of the types of research methods that are used in different schools of thought. And that'll be really useful for you uh, not just in this module, but also across the board, thinking about uh, psychology research and how it's conducted, uh, not just in terms of the nuts and bolts of the studies, but what's the philosophy that underpins them. So hopefully you'll get something uh, useful from these sessions, from these videos. Uh, if you've got any questions, then post them in the discussion board on now. Um, but I'll now go straight on to uh, the first uh, video clip looking at the founders of modern psychology.